Alrighty, welcome back. We are um, making our way to the Leap 4 here. We've got kind of the team mocked up and ready to go. Check out last episode to see what type we lost at the end. Let me do a quick recap of attacks, because a few things changed, because I, I finally used some of my TMs. It's a good try attack. Thunder Wave Discharge and Flash Cannon on Invisible Man. Jackalope still rocking the strength. Double hit. Grass Knot. Shadow Claw. And we got Godzilla here with Bulldoze, Crunch, Rock Slide, and Dragon Claw. I do have the Earthquake TM, but I don't know if he learns it naturally in the next couple levels, so we're going to wait and see. Frankenstein. Crunch, Earthquake. <sighs> Ice Fang and Fire Fang. Demon. I decided to go ahead and add the Flamethrower TM. And then we have Poison Jab, Smart Strike, and Stomp. Dorian Gray, Aerial Ace, I got rid of Quick Attack for Fly, just as a stronger flying move, slash, don't really need Quick Attack because it's fast, uh, Close Combat and Steel Wing. And that's the, uh, that's the squad we're, uh, we're pushing along with. And we're just gonna battle a bunch of trainers, we're gonna work our way towards the Elite Four, and we're not going to let any Pokemon die. That is the goal. Because we only have one backup Pokemon. And... I don't believe there's another encounter that we can get. Oh, also, I gave them all ball capsules, so, like, you just noticed, Magnezone had his, like, electricity when he pops out. So each Pokemon has some fun little stuff now. Since this is going to be the main squad uh, that we are rocking out with. Alright, Jackalope hits 50. Frankenstein hits 50. Double edge? Nope. I did not want to hit that. Okay. Giving up on double edge. Yeah, we lost eight typings. So please, if everyone can just check it out and, you know, see kind of what we can or can't lose. Can or can't, sorry, can or can't use. I said, I said lose. That was in reference to what we did lose. <laughs> Alright, Dorian Gray hits 49. I also have to figure out, um, I don't want Brave Bird because it can damage me. Um, I also have to figure out kind of what, something, oh, level, level limits. Um, I want something in the middle. The first couple Elite Four members, I might be over leveled, but I know the last couple, I'm going to be like super... Like, I'm correctly leveled, so. <laughs> we're just going to have to figure out kind of what we're doing here for that. Alright, this is a double battle. I feel like I should take it on as a double battle. No, I shouldn't actually. I shouldn't take this on as a double battle at all because, or if I do, actually, if I am gonna do a double battle, I need to use Pokemon that are not gonna hurt each other, like an electric move on a flying type. <laughs> kind of dangerous. I do see some items over there. I'm going to come back through. Do all the items later. Dude, why don't you have some evolved Pokemon? There's two awesome...
shots of some of our ball capsule abilities for when we call out both Dorian Gray and Jackalope. I mean, I'm just going to try to do a bunch of damage to some Pokemon. <sighs> All right, first level 51 is going to be Invisible Man. Next time, next we go into a Quagsire and Gold Duck. So now we're going into some evolved Pokemon. Um, I'm going to go Aerial Ace into the Gold Duck, and I'm going to go Grass Knot into the Quagsire. Big damage, knocks him out. Okay, solid damage with the Aerial Ace. Goes into the Aqua Tail. It's like a little bit of damage there, but we do have leftovers. Okay, calls out the Pelipper. Okay, starts drizzling, which is kind of a bummer. I'm just going to repeat what I just did. And then use double hit on Pelipper. He avoids, which sucks. Nice big damage on Gold Duck knocks him out. And another Wingle. Okay. Um Fly up and use it on Pelipper. Double hit on Pelipper. Ba boom. Ba boom. Oh wow, Wingle's faster than Dorian. They're gray. Or speed time, maybe. I don't know. Not super pumped about the confusion here. Okay, flies up high. Decides to stockpile, which kind of sucks. Okay, and then I'm going to double hit into the Wingle. Should effectively knock this out. Yep, right away. Nails it with a fly. And takes them out. Awesome. It's a pretty long battle for only taking like 40 health, I think, for the entire battle. Okay. I mean, I'm just going to heal him up real quick. Keep Dorian Gray in front because then he can catch him up to the rest of the squad. We're just going to keep pushing on, pushing on. Tentacle, okay. Use a strong fly here. Now oh, he's gonna acid armor. That's kind of a bummer. Not a huge fan of that. Another acid armor. Okay. You know what? You're you're effectively getting real annoying real quick, bud. Third acid armor. 
This thing's defenses are nuts. Alright, let's go right for the discharge. It does get a water bottle off on me, which is kind of a bummer. But we'll eat that, and then we'll go ahead and discharge. Boom! Got it. Super good, super good. Saved a lot of time. Okay, Jackalope is at 51. Dorian Gray catches up to level 50. I am going to dodge a handful of trainers. I will come back for those guys. I just kind of wanted to at least get to something important here. Okay, we're going to have to battle her, so we're just going to go right into it. Boom. There's nothing but water encounters in this. Our next step is to go to Victory Road. If we have any chance of anything that we can use. Like team wise, it would be in Victory Road. But I don't even know that um, we would want to switch out any of the team members right now. Oh, well, that's scary. I'm like a minus three now. <laughs> Go right into the aerial ice and just take this guy out. But that, that's, that's kind of stressful. Because I was minus like three on defense there. He goes aqua tail. He could, could probably kill me. Um, but yeah, so even if we get some kind of Pokemon that we could potentially use from the cave, the level will be lower. Plus our team is pretty well stacked to defend itself. Oh, here's a potential encounter. Tentacruel. This is uh, Species Claws because we already have a Tentacool that we couldn't use because we lost uh, water typing so early on in the game. But not only that, but we've lost poison typing. So, Tentacruel, super cool. If we had access to use him on the team, I would actually consider it. But we don't. I'm just going to run away. Okay, we made it to the waterfall. I'm actually going to battle whoever this closest person is. You. Battle me. We're going to battle real quick, and then we'll pop up and get to our next chunk. I'm not going to record all of... Oh, this thing could have Ice Fang. That's stressful. Uh, I'm not going to record all of Victory Road. We're going to record at least one, maybe two episodes of it. Um, because I know people are going to want to see if I screw up, if I mess up, if I run into a trainer that I don't have <coughs> a good answer for. You know, it's content. It's something that people are going to want to see. Okay, next we got Gyarados. Goes for Scary Face. Not a huge fan of Scary Face, but we'll deal with that. One big discharge should do it here. For some reason goes for another Scary Face. Nice. Knock him out. Put him on his ass. Adios. Alright. Demon catches up. He has 51 as well. Alright. Gonna pop up here. Pelipper, this is dupe or species clause. We caught a wingle that we can't use. Oh my gosh, guys, come on. I just want to get up the waterfall to end the episode. And we'll pop up here. Now that we've officially gotten to the Pokemon League, 
And that's it. So thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time. See ya.